Hi, kingfishers and wagtails. Well, it is nearly blast off time in our space shuttle. Are you ready? We're going to do a countdown. Are you ready? Here we go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Zero. Lift off. Houston, we have lift off. Our story today is called Space Shuttle Blasts Off. And we're in our space shuttle here in, in uh, Kingfisher um, Space Station. Space Shuttle is on the launch pad at the Space Centre. The tank and rocket boosters are full of fuel. We're going to collect a broken satellite, says Commander Mandy. When the astronauts are strapped in, the ground crew locks the shuttle door. In the control room, the countdown begins. The astronauts do their last checks. Everything is working fine. All systems go, says Commander Mandy. Prepare for liftoff. Ten, nine, eight. Commander Mandy starts the main engines. Seven, six, five, four. Maximum power, shouts Commander Mandy. Three, two, one, roar, lift off. With a terrific blast, Space Shuttle rises from the launch pad. Space Shuttle soars higher and higher. Soon it is high above the ocean. Release the rocket boosters, shouts Commander Mandy. Check, says co-pilot Andy, flipping the switch. The empty rocket boosters fall away. They splash down into the sea. A ship is waiting to collect them. The crew can see the Earth below as Space Shuttle flies into space. Release the fuel tank, orders Commander Mandy. Clunk. Check, says co-pilot Andy. The empty fuel tank burns up as it tumbles back to the Earth. Commander Mandy steers Space Shuttle into orbit around the Earth. Look, that must be the broken satellite, says co-pilot Andy. Clever. They are clever pandas, aren't they? Space Shuttle moves into position below the satellite. Commander Mandy opens the cargo door. Co-pilot Andy moves the joystick to control the robot arm. Brrr. Carefully does it, says Commander Mandy. The arm grips the satellite and pulls it into the cargo bay. What a weird satellite, says Commander Mandy. The crew prepare to close the cargo door. Suddenly, they hear a strange sound. Knock, knock. Maybe the cargo doors are stuck, says Commander Mandy. I'll go outside and look. It's spacewalk time. Commander Mandy puts on her spacesuit and helmet. The shuttle door opens and she floats out into space. She comes face to face with an alien. You've got my spaceship, says the alien. Let us go, or my children will be late for school on Mars. Whoops, sorry, says Commander Mandy. We thought you were a satellite. Oh dear. Space Shuttle releases the alien spaceship. Thanks, Earthings, says the alien. Next stop, Mars. Zoom! The spaceship flies off. The astronauts soon spot the real broken satellite. They load it into the cargo bay and close the cargo doors. Click. Mission accomplished, says Commander Mandy. Space Shuttle glides back to Earth. It lands with a gentle bump and rolls to a halt. The crew transporter collects the crew. Hold on, who is that? <gasps> it's a stowaway alien! Space Shuttle is more fun than school, she squeaks. Uh-oh, sighs Commander Mandy. Space Shuttle to blast off again. Let's look at the space shuttle. So we've got a rudder at the back, a vertical flap on a tail. We've got the main engines, uh, we've got the elebons, which are the flaps on the wings, and we've got the delta wings, the rocket boosters, the fuel tank, the crew module, which is the flight deck, the cargo bay, the cargo doors, and the vertical stabiliser that's on the tail. So the good, good diagram there. And here we have other space vehicles. So the shuttle carrier aircraft, so that helps to bring it down back to Earth. The crawler transporter, 
the fuel tank transporter and the crew transporter. And there's Commander Mandy and the stowaway alien. Well, I hope you enjoyed that story at Kingfishers and Wagtails. And I hope that you've enjoyed learning about the space shuttle. Take care. Bye.